Hello everybody, welcome back. SOE Lysander by Historic Wings designed by Thomas Van Hare. I'm starting another campaign as um, if you watched my other videos, <laughs> we uh, kind of got a new set of pajamas last mission. So I'm going to be rolling up Eddie Atkinson. Um, I had to get the name first so I knew what to name my video. So I already did that and I'm in the process right now of. Um, entering things in here um so we know the name i got the name um and i'm gonna roll him up basically just go through the sop and roll a new character but i am going to start in august i was talking with thomas about it and i was going to restart in june but i think i will just go ahead and have him come in as a replacement to replace um to replace my uh previous pilot who did not fare too well um so let's go ahead and get rolled up here not going to get to of course if i get the right thing down here pilot training roll on a1 and i roll a seven the generalist i don't like the generalist at all we get three of each jet which is not the greatest roll it's the most common one because it's a seven, but it's not the greatest roll. And um, set, set six cents, three. Set pilotage, three. Set moxie, three. We're done with that. Um, next, we go to uh, initial rank, rolling A2. And, excuse me, and we got an 8. That's going to be a Flight Sergeant Zero chip, so we're off to a very good start here. And we're going to roll for starting flight time on A3. I really need a good roll here to get some extra chips. 6, and we did not get it. Um, 350 plus 4 die 6. So that is 7, 17, so 350, 367. For day hours, and night hours are 200 plus 2d6. I oh, know 100 plus 2d6. <laughs> Trying to cheat. 107. All right. I wonder where I put that other name. <laughs> Who knows what I'm doing half the time. Uh, let's see here. We go on to aircraft assignment, A4. Okay, I won't make it AB, uh, MAB because MAB went down in flames. So we will make it 4 MAG. So I'll set my fuselage code MAG. Set up pilot name. I have to come up with that yet. Um, I lost my charts and I need that. The 9356 fuselage code. All right, and what do we want to call her? Um, let's call her Bessie. Greta didn't do very well. All right, that gets us going there. Uh, name and starting base. Name your pilot and Lysander. Gameplay begins at Tempsford. I already have Tempsford up there. Um, so we're going to be coming into August now. I called it August 7th. Um, and that's where we're going to start at. So I have everything ready there. I did add, uh, Thomas and I were 
joking around about my poor dice rolling. So as a uh, kind of a joke on me, and um, I added to the Vassal page a house roll dice blessing button extension for the game. So if you decide that you need a little help, you, once permission, you can use the dice blessing. And what will happen is you'll hit the dice blessing. That'll give you a nice little sound. And and it'll re-roll the 2d6 for you. And so, as you can see, my dice rolling is in... in, peck, in oh, boy. I'm trying to use English. I'm no good at English. So, impeccable. So, I've got uh, a, a 5 there, which was an awesome roll and would have gotten me in even more trouble. And I can no longer use that for the mission until I go ahead and end the mission, and then I get it back. And you can move out anywhere as you want it. Just a little something I added in. I did also change the artwork. Thomas made me a nice button for the draw train card. I changed the, the default pilot pictures, though you can still go through and set them all on your own. So when you're playing a different counter, you can always choose your own pilot picture. I think there's seven of them to choose from. Um can't choose your own luck though you're screwed with that if you're like me circuit assignments we're going to roll for the current month's uh uh table bx circuit assignments and that is in august of 43 2d6 a nine parson and archdeacon they're not they're not horrible assignments i can actually deal with them parson is five four And Archdeacon. Archdeacon. It, actually, 5-4 is kind of a dangerous one. Because um, four channel cards, your chances of getting something nasty are pretty pretty good. 6-2 for Archdeacon. All right. Now we're going to roll for the pilot training, but we did not complete any missions. No awards, no promotions, mission assignments. We'll go down here and get our assignments. Uh, I'm going to roll the 2d6 up here, and we're going to use the white dice for the outbound and the black dice for the inbound, and we get a 2 and a 2. Actually, this is not bad. Four cargo on the packs. A little heavy on the cargo, but I can deal with that. Last time, I was rolling everybody very heavy. And then one packs and documents on the way back. And the other thing I did was cargo and packs. I put the the mascots down here so you can't use them and, and grab them. To, grab them as special. So on the way over, we need one passenger. That's going to be the fiddler and four cargo. One, two, three, four. And then we're going to have the documents on the way back with one passenger. And um. We won't be using him. <laughs> I'm getting all the pilots. Belladonna. We'll bring Belladonna back. All right. And now for Archdeacon, we're going to do the same thing. Three and a five. Two passenger, two cargo on the way back. I mean, on the way out. That's not a horrible load. And then five. Five is three passengers on the way back. Uh, it's kind of a heavy load, but at least we don't have uh, cargo. And uh, two passengers on the way over. Pencil. And the chaplain with two cargo. Dang guns. Dang guns. And then three passengers on the way back. Sir Spani's going to come back. Diplomat's going to come back. And we're not a pilot. We can only bring back Eighth Air Force, and or he, uh, he can take him back. He's coming back up a, a down the airplane. All right, so we have that set up. Positioning: We're going to fly our Lysander to Tangmere and put an hour of daylight flying onto our, and we're going to call that August seventh because the eighth is the first of the. Uh, uh, first of the. Uh, and I'm going to put that 1000. First of the new moon, uh, full moon, rather. 
and we're going to put transfer. And we're going to put one hour daylight. No fuel, no fuel, no fuel. Good to go. That's done. Now we can go to mission preparation. I can get this out of the way for the time being. I'll pull the charts out of the way for the time being. Um, mission preparation right over here. First night marker. Um, choose a mission. Four cargo and two passengers. Four cargo is going to be a minus three, minus four. And then we have two cargo and two passengers, which is going to be a minus two. So early on, you know what? I'm going to try Archdeacon first because that's the easier one. So if I get really good weather in these early nights, maybe I'll, I'll try that one. So we're going to try Archdeacon. Weather determination first. We check for... Um, Current weather. We're in August. Current weather's <laughs> special mission right off the bat. We are awesome. Very awesome. We roll 33. 33 is a do or die mission to Archdeacon. So we're going to Archdeacon whether we like it or not, and that's do or die. So that means we've got to try it whether we like it or not. Archdeacon 6 2. And that is a do or die mission. So we've got to make that a red S. Pick up Bomber Command, Wing Commander, and Stephonicus. I guess he got shot down. Um, with photographs of plans for the Arado AR-234V1 prototype jet. So now that is our primary concern. So that is our mission. We are once again rolling for weather now. We're still going to Archdeacon, but with a whole different agenda. So we roll a 36 now in August weather, and that's going to get us a heavy cloud or current. Oh, this is just wonderful. We're starting out awesomely here. Second weather is a 65, even better. Fog at the landing. Oh, that's not even the right chit that I put there. And then fog. And then landing. Wind. All right. And there is no such thing as say on, say off, or do or die. So we are going to go ahead and put out our Tangmere card. And that is six cards. Three sixth one is down here, landing zone. So we're gonna flip that bad boy over. We're gonna put out the weather. <sighs> Current weather was heavy cloud. I've seen worse. We don't have a choice. We're flying in this. Um, landing zone was fog. Goes over here. And I'm going to put these guys over here right now while I'm there. And then we've got uh, wind on the way back. A little bit of everything going on here. What a forecast. All right. Um, we don't have a choice. We are flying this one. Yeah, special missions in do or die are always say on. So, um, Tang Mir card at the left edge and landing zone at the right edge. Current chits, done that. Current WFX, we have that. Refer to circuit assignments and draw the TC values for a selected mission. And that is going to be six and two. So, we got two channel cards. Three, four, five, and then sixth is always your. Um, Landing card. Your your last card is always your landing card. 
I'm going to flip these over and plan our mission. And we better plan this well because I like the channel cards. I, the village. Actually, I don't mind that village because I can fly over that. And that's good uh, modification right there. The plus two for getting lost. These fields, don't like them. The forest, I'm all right with the forest. So we've only got one card I don't like. And I'm going to discard that one and draw that down. Oops. France. And we're going to flip that over. Oh boy, that's a city. So I'm going to go ahead and spend a six cents card, char, card to get rid of that. Because I'm not liking where we're at already on that one. So we're going to put this up. That should be ready to fly. And then I'm going to six cents. One six cents to get rid of that card and draw another France card and flip that over. Hills. That's not bad. So we've only got one real card to worry about besides the weather and the and the night time the night time is going to be horrible we don't have a choice we have to actually go for it um Let's see here. Uh, on place card TCs, reshuffle. That's what I keep forgetting to do. So we will reshuffle them back in there because we got to get that city card back in there in case I get lost. That killed me on the last mission. Uh, make up operation name. Um, Archdeacon. I'm going to call that Operation Church. This is the 8th. The first night, so we've got to go to the calendar too. Eighth, right? I am in August, and I'm looking. It is the eighth, yes. So I'm going to clone that and put that on the eighth. I really don't like going out on that first night, but do or die, you don't have a choice. Eight eight nineteen forty three. What a shame. Poor rookie comes out of uh, out for his first mission, and what's he get? Four, 40 minutes. 21.40 is our start time. M-A-G. All right, uh, this is Operation... That'll be Archdeacon. We are going out empty. And we're coming back with the passengers. And, um... We're going to go ahead and roll here. Let's see here. We are done with that. We've got to figure out. We don't have any chits to put down. We don't have any die damage. Uh, we've got to figure out fuel. I have 12 cards to cover. I like to have room to wiggle, so we're going to put 16 down. Uh, destination marker and archdeacon. Right there. And then proceed to SOPD takeoff. Get rid of my assignments right now. Get rid of my calendar right now. I can find my chart, maybe. And we are going to take off. And this is going to be a rough one because we have a minus four night right now. Uh, weather effects at low altitude and heavy cloud. That's going to be a minus one. Minus 4 is a minus 5. Fuel DRM, minus 6, minus 7. Cargo DM, nothing. Damage DRM and fax DRM, nothing. So we got a minus 7 to start right off. I'm going to go ahead and use one Moxie to make it kind of um, decent for us. So that's going to be a minus 4. And we roll 5 right off the bat. Possible engine failure. 6, 
uh, no failure, safe talk, ta safe talk, oh, yeah, safe take off. <laughs> Where's my mind at? And I didn't want assignments, I want my log. So we got a safe talk, uh, engine sputter, safe take off. All right. Um, that's a good start, though. That's one of the key head, key uh, critical problems, and we only used two ch only used two chits so far. So, um, we are going to determine the weather effects for the next, and hope we're hoping for good weather now, because we really need some benefits to get rid of that minus four there. Uh, first roll is a six, and that's going to move one towards the right landing zone and then we're going to roll a four so that's only one move so that's going to take us to regular clouds which is a lot better than heavy clouds so i'll take that not that i have a choice i'm going to stay at uh, don't need optional reveal i'm going to stay at low altitude we're going to move to the next card and use up one fuel Uh, we don't have to check for icing. We don't have to check for weather effects damage. There is no night fighter follow following. There is no uh, threats. Decision point none. Off course check. We will determine if we are or are, are off course or not. All right, so here's the big one. This is the next big hurdle we have to cross. Uh, where are my charts again? I lost my charts. There we go. Um, off course. Apply to nav DRM, which is a minus one. Weather affects DRM at low. Zero. Actually, we, I think we use that minus one. That's a minus two. Night DRM is minus 4, which goes to minus 6. No wind, so we're at a minus 6. Nine goes down to a three. Off course, no sign of expected waypoint. Place draw and place TCs face down flight to landing zone if outbound or tang near. I can choose the orbit or I can choose the bull rush ahead. You know what, in this bad weather, I really don't think it's going to benefit me to keep using cards up. Because we, you know, at least not, I can try maybe on the way back because I have some beneficial cards here. But until we hit that village, we don't have much of anything that's really good. I'll just have to start flying by the uh, seat of my pants here. I don't know whether I really want to do that. Um, yeah, with all them bad modifiers, I'm looking at a minus six. The best I can, I need a 10, 11, or 12 to do anything. And if I, if I even orbit, I'm going to be at a minus 10, so I need a snake eyes only to, I mean, a, a, a box cars only to, uh, to uh, do it. Minus 6. Actually, I need uh, uh, minus 6, yeah, 10 or more. Minus, minus, if I orbit, I don't stand a chance. Hey, I'm going to go with just going ahead and being lost. Um, so we're going to go ahead, draw and place face down for flight, the landing zone, or Tang Mir. I'm just going to go ahead and put channel, France, 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 and this is dangerous, but what can we do? Um, I'm not going to waste all my chits right away. All right, so we are off course, too. I've got to go ahead and put a counter down there. I don't think there's an off course when I use the lost one. 
we're not completely lost, but we're off course. All right, um, so we're going to go to the weather effects for the next one, and now we're now we're looking for trouble here. So um, I think it's channel on safe going low. Uh, we're hoping for the best. Uh, rolling for weather in the next TC, we roll a four. That's going to move it one more towards the uh, landing zone, so that's going to get us in clouds again. And then we roll a six, which is going to move it one more into clear, which is good for us finding our way and not having bad weather, but it's bad because we're going to be getting spotted easier. But the night dime does affect that, so that's the other thing we have going for us. All right, optional reveal. I'm not going to do that because it's the English Channel, and I am going to stay low. We're going to fly move to the next TC so I can change this one over. And, of course, that's a night fighter. Ah, boy. And low is the worst possible altitude to have on that. So we're going to check for... Um, Icing and stuff. We don't have any icing or weather. No night fighter following. Resolve threats. We got the night fighter. So we're adding weather effects DRM and the night DRM. So we're going to add four to our dice roll. We're hoping to roll really high on this one. And then um, I think fuel would take off for that. So we're going to add two. Nine, ten, eleven. We don't get him. We do not get him. Nice. That's the first time I had a good roll, and I would have rolled my blessing just to try to get around that one if I hadn't made it. Decision point, no. Off course check. We're already off course. I don't really think we have to keep rolling for that. Um, but we'll roll for it regardless. Um, minus one, minus two, two three, four, five, minus five. It's down to a one. Wow. That's a hopelessly lost return to Tang Mir. Do or die. I don't think we have a choice if we're hopefully, hopelessly lost. we got to go and try it again, I believe. Uh, let's go in here and do or die. Search the rules real quick just to make sure. I think it's my first do or die mission, actually. Hmm. Must be flown immediately on the current night, no matter what the weather effects is. Door to eye requirements are considered to be so important that you must fly them on each successive night until it's successfully completed. So yeah, I don't mind this so much. We're just going to go ahead and continue to be hopelessly lost. We are going to go ahead and face home, return to Tangmere, draw and place TCs face down for the return flight to Tangmere and, and for each TC in the direction of the landing zone. So we're going to go ahead and get one more channel card there. Um, we're hopelessly lost. And we're returning home. So we're going to go ahead. I don't mind that so much. We'll try it again the next night. Weather effects for the next TC. And we're going to be using the um, current weather. I just went through this to current weather. And I just found it. And I bet you I won't be able to find it again. Return flights, current weather, early early return, found it right away. If during a mission your pilot gets hopelessly lost um, and has to return to RAF Tangmir so that your projected arrival is within one hour of the return flight, instead of using the forecast at Tangmir, use the current weather effects at Tangmir to govern the movement of the WX marker. So our current weather will be the movement Take off heavy cloud. Yeah, heavy cloud. All right, so um, heavy clouds down here. So we're going to roll once. Four is going to move it once in that direction. And then we roll again. Three doesn't move it. So we're going to have clouds to deal with, which might not be bad.
and um, optional reveal. You know what? I got it. We're going to use a sixth sense to reveal that card. And that's got a night fighter. Actually, with the nighttime, that doesn't scare me a whole lot. Nighttime and clouds. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to I'm going to keep going, and we're going to do medium. It can get worse than that card. Um, so I'm going to go medium. Fly to the next TC. Use up another fuel. Um, no icing or damage checks. Uh, night fighter following. None. Resolve threats. We have a five. We're adding four for the night and we're subtracting one. So we're adding three. And we roll a 10, 13. We avoid the night fighters again. Decision point no. Off course check. Doesn't matter because we're next card is Tang Mir. So we're going to go back up and resolve the weather for Tang Mir. What we're, la what we're landing in. One, we roll, does not do anything, and a three does not do anything, so it's going to be cloud for our return to Tang Mir. Uh, optional reveal, don't need it. Select altitude, I'm going to go to low. Fly move to the next TC, use up another fuel. And no icing damage, no night fighters following, no threats to resolve. Decision point, yes, we're going to go straight to D5. And we are applying WX weather effects at low, which is zero. Night DRM minus four, fuel DRM goes down to minus five. That is it, minus five, and we can add one for each moxie chit. So I'm going to go ahead and add two moxie chits to make it a minus three. Give us somewhat of a chance here. A six goes down to a three. Successful landing, no damage. Proceed with mission. And I closed that. Why did I do that? Hopelessly lost. Let's put that in our... Hope we lost safe landing. Um, D5, then SOPG. Medicinal whiskey, D18. We roll a three. Bam. Rare. Distillery warehouses were bombed on August. B A N F F. Yeah, a nice, nice rare bottle then. Cool. Uh, records keeping. We logged the events already. And the next step, we go to SOPH. Advance the night, mark, the night marker to the next night. Uh, repair of Lysander. We have no damage, no wounds to heal. And then we're going to proceed to SOPC and start it all over again. And end the mission. And there you have it. We'll try that one again the next night. We will see you guys next time. You all have a great night. And um, thanks for joining me.